DCHS and welcome back to Tiger Media. I'm Addison Swisher and I'm Liam Wallace. Thursday, September 22nd. Everyone come out and watch the Powder Puff game starting at 6 p.m. Admission is $5. After school has officially started, the events that will be held are homework help, credit recovery, chess with Mr. Gully, on the same page with Miss Robinson, cooking at home with Miss Paris, steam activities with Miss Farrell, and walking club. Don't forget, Tiger Boutique is next week, Tuesday, September 27th. Please bring in your gently used clothes without any tears, rips, stains, or odors. All items are to be brought into the auditorium. On Wednesday, October 26th, we will be having a blood drive from 7.30 a.m. to 1.30 p.m. It will be located on the Blood Mobile in the back of the school parking lot. To schedule an appointment, go to bloodassurance.org slash DeKalb High School or see Ms. Kelly Agee for the sign-up sheet. Remember to eat a good meal, drink additional water, and avoid energy drinks. 16-year-old students bring signed parental consent forms and a photo ID. All donors will receive a breakfast sandwich. This is an announcement for anyone driving in the homecoming parade. Everyone driving in the parade must be parked and in first period by 745. Bring all of your decorations with you because you will not be permitted to leave school after being parked. You must pay to drive in the parade and you will be assigned a parking number. Remember this number. Only two people per vehicle, one passenger and one driver. You will lose your parking pass for two weeks if you have more than one passenger in your vehicle. No obscene or overly loud music, no obscene posters or displays, no flags other than the American or school flags, no vulgar language written on vehicles, no profanity or suggestive language or images, no squalling tires. Decorations must be firmly attached and remain on the vehicle. Anyone parking at the square, drivers must park in the spaces around the square or just off the square. Do not park in the roadway. You must remain in the vehicle at all times. Keep hands, feet, and objects in the vehicle. And do not throw anything out of your vehicle. Leave adequate space between vehicles. Remain in your original position. Please act civilized. After the parade, if you return to campus, you must stay on campus. Hi DCHS, I have your activity schedule regarding homecoming next week. Monday is the powder puff game. Tuesday is volleyball. Wednesday is 3v3 basketball. Thursday is dodgeball. On Friday, we have our parade and the game that night. Go Tigers! <laughs> Thanks, Addison. I'm Aiden Turner. And I'm Carly Beckham. And we'll be bringing you this week's sports news. This past Friday, the Tigers football team took on Cumberland County. In a conference game, in the first half, the Tigers pulled ahead with a good lead of 28-6. Despite the various onside kick attempts by the Jets, the Tigers still held strong and pushed their lead even further in the second half with a final score of 48-13 to cap. The Tigers are now 4-1 overall with a 1-1 record in conference standings. This Friday, September 23rd, the Tigers will be on the road for a border rivalry against Cannon County. Kickoff will be at 7 p.m. as always. Be sure to come and support your Tigers. The girls' soccer team has a home game tonight against Kermelin County at 6. They also have another home game this Thursday against White County at 6. Admission will be $5. The golf team has a region tournament Monday, September 26th at Golden Eagle Golf Course in Cookville. The cross country team has a meet this Saturday in Cookville at 10 a.m. Make sure to come out and support your Tigers. Thank you for watching DCHS Tiger Media. One driver and one passenger. You will lose your parking pass for two weeks if you have more than one vehicle. It, oh my gosh. Bro was rolling the whole time too. Please bring in your gently used clothes without any tears, rips, stains, or odors. All items are to be brought into the auditorium. On Wednesday, October 26th, we will be having a blood drive from 7.30 a.m. to 10... It is not 10.30, it is 1.30. On Wednesday, October 26th, we will be having a blood drive from 7.30 a.m. to 1.30 p.m. It will be located on the mobile... Oh my gosh,
Okay. Now for real. For real. This is the last <laughs> one. You said that the first time. Nick. No, then you. Okay, I messed up the first time. The rest of them was you. Come support your Tigers. The girls' soccer team has a home game tonight against six. Um, against six. Keep going. What is that? You said I was going to mess up. <laughs> Look at you. Go. The girls' soccer team has a home game tonight against Cumberland County at six. You messed that up too. The golf team has a region tournament Monday, September 26th at Golden that? Eagle Golf Course in Cookville. No, you said Cannon County. That's White County. Can you read? I was reading this. I said Cumberland County. No, you already read that. No, I didn't. I was restarting. 